Yo, what's going on YouTube? Recently, I was challenged to get my CCNA. And if you're unaware of how this actually took place, I'm gonna tell you a little story. Last week in Network Chuck's live stream, I sent him a super chat and said, hey, I'm looking to study my CCNA. Do you have any advice? And he gave me a few little bits and tips of advice. And he said, you know what? I'm going to challenge you to get your CCNA in six months. He said, you have six months to get your ICND-1 and your ICND-2, and I know you can do it. So he essentially put the pressure on me after I was just merely bringing up a question on what advice or suggestions that he had for me, because this is something that I'm really actually serious about getting. It's something that I really wanna do because it actually pertains to my future. So he challenged me and I'm accepting. I am going to get my CCNA in the next six months. There's no doubt in my mind that that is something that I can achieve and something that I can do. And if you are unaware, I'm currently studying for my Security Plus, and the Security Plus is gonna be something I'm getting hopefully in the beginning of March there. And I'm really excited about that, but I'm even more excited now to get my CCNA because it's something that I've really been wanting for a very, very long time. And just to show kind of how dedicated I am, I went out and bought one of David Bombel's courses on the CCNA so I could study for that and use it on my own time, use it on something that I purchased and I paid for because it's something that I believe in and something that I feel really strongly about. So I'm about 11% done with that course right now. And I'm actually really excited about it because as I was going through the course, there's a couple different quizzes and I was getting quizzed on binary and things like that. And it's, I was just nailing the binary questions. It was stuff that I've studied like last year, maybe about two years ago or so, and I just remembered everything. I remembered how subnetting works. So going forward with that course is something that you're going to hear a lot about because it's something that I'm really excited about. And if you're unaware of why the CCNA is so important and why the Security Plus is so important, the CCNA and the Security Plus are crucial to my path into the world of cybersecurity. That is the field that I ultimately want to end up in for my career. So getting those two certifications are something that are actually really important to that path. So for me, moving forward, going to get these certifications, studying for these certifications, you're gonna hear a little bit about those things on this channel, but if you really wanna dive deep into hearing my journey into cybersecurity, you can check out my other YouTube channel that I just launched that's called Learn Cybersecurity, which is going to chronicle my entire journey through learning everything I can to get myself into a cybersecurity career. Now, if you guys wanna follow along with me in the CCNA journey, I'll put a link in the description to the course that I purchased from David Bombel. You guys, by all means, don't feel obligated to follow along for any reason. This is something that I'm truly passionate about that's some, and it's something that I ultimately wanna do because it's going to better myself. Some of the videos that you'll be seeing coming out very soon are just some of the things that I'm learning with the CCNA so far. So we're gonna talk a lot about the OSI model. We're gonna talk a lot about binary and we're gonna talk about um, subnetting as well. And I'm gonna to try to explain these things and have you understand them in the way that I do because it took me a long time to understand some of this stuff. So if I can try to explain these things in a way that maybe you guys can also understand that, and you know maybe I'm, I'm looking at these in a way that you guys have no idea what networking is and how it works, that's the kind of approach that I wanna take with you guys. I'm not doing a course in these things necessarily. I'm just gonna kinda of give you guys little bits of fundamentals on why these things are important and crucial to the CCNA. So as I'm going through this CCNA track, you guys will hear about some of the most important things that I think that I'm learning through the courses that I'm taking with David Bombel. With the Security Plus, you guys are also going to hear about a lot of the different things that I'm learning on that course as well. So, so the point of this video is to let you guys know that I have accepted the challenge of the CCNA. So thank you, Network Chuck, for putting me on the spot. Your challenge has been accepted and I'm really excited to do it. So that's it for today's video. If you guys have any comments, questions, or concerns, you can hit me up in the comments below. As always, take it easy.